Stop licking me. <laughs> okay. What the hell? <laughs> All right, are we ready? I don't have a bra on. Neither do I. <laughs> I'm just sagging it. Oh, okay. One, two, <clears throat> what are we saying? <laughs> Someone's gonna click on this video and be like, oh my god, why is she crying already? <laughs> You're never gonna get through this. <laughs> You're never gonna get through this. <laughs> One hour later. Okay. Hi, Hi Artemis! Yay, we did it! <laughs> oh man. <clears throat> I'm really hoping that my microphone is gonna work from this far away. I've never filmed from this far away. So this is going to be trial and error. Um, it's taken us like an hour to try and get this video up because I can't stop laughing. <laughs> and it was just a total fiasco. So, and uh, Bailey apparently just has to be in the picture with us. So, yes. <laughs> Dog nation. <laughs> um <clears throat> So we're going to be doing two videos, uh, but this time we're going to be doing a yarn fairy video. Yay! <coughs> Yay! I got my... <coughs> I'm okay. You have water. Water. Water, water. <laughs> oh, hang on. <coughs> oh, God. Okay. My Hobie order came in. <laughs> What are you doing? We're dancing. <coughs> oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's enough out of you. Oh, okay, so we figured out that the dog is trying to hump my foot. This is not good. Stop it. Oh, <clears throat> okay, um, we figured out that when we open this, you're not going to be able to see it from this far away. So Tia's going to move and she. I'm going to move closer to the camera so you can see it. Yeah. <laughs> oh. She's like, Mommy, play. <laughs> oh. Oh, God, God my heart. <laughs> oh. Oh. Okay. <clears throat> anyway. Relax. Okay. Relax. Yeah, relax. Chill. Relax. <laughs> okay. So. We're going to open this up and hopefully we're going to get through this video because holy man, this has just been like, wow. <clears throat> okay. Also, oh. <laughs> <laughs> let us know if you like the whole lighting situation. Yes. Because it's yes. new. Yes. I got a ring light. Finally. Yay. <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> um, <clears throat> so we're still trying to figure out the, it looks really, really bright to us. So I don't know if we're totally washed out or if we're okay. So like, don't cut the yarn, okay? <laughs> no, I'm not. There's a lot in here. I don't even remember what I ordered. So what am I gonna do? What? <clears throat> oh, okay. excuse okay. me, guys. <laughs> She's gonna be my Vanna White. <gasps> oh, sorry. <laughs> the guy that instructed me at school, he called me that too. Oh. <laughs> Because I would like pick up the colored steaks and then everyone else would figure out what it was. Ah, oh god. <laughs> okay. I don't even know who she is. Uh, what? You I don't, don't know who Vanna White is? No. Alright, so I got a bunch of stuff in here. <clears throat> but I got a couple of the I think I showed these to you guys before. 
um, but they were in different colors. They're the Soft Spotlight, <coughs> excuse me, they have the reflective um, thread in them. And this one is 86% premium acrylic and 14% reflective yarn. <coughs> and it is <coughs> um, 70 yards. And it doesn't have, does it have, a, it's just got a, a number for the uh, color, but it's number 17. Did, can they see the reflective? Yeah. yeah. So I got a couple of those. <clears throat> and then I got a couple in, ugh. okay, I got three of those. And then I got three in this blue color. And the color number is 13. <clears throat> but it's really cool because when the light hits it, when you're out at night, it's really, you have to hold it like that <laughs> well, <laughs> so that they the can actually it. see, yeah, so they can actually see, well, the name and the, you know, color. Fine. <laughs> <laughs> so there you go. You can, I don't know if you can see it. Can you see the lines? Yeah. So when, when this shows up at night, it's like freaking light show it's awesome it's awesome so this would be really good for like dog coats oh this is that <clears> stuff <throat> yeah or for people that are out that do running or walking at night oh. um you can make a hat for them out of this and the cars will see them Ooh. okay so i also got um <clears throat> I can't remember. I think there was a, a YouTuber that showed this on one of their videos and I had to go and get it. I don't know. I can't remember off the top of my head who it was. <clears throat> um, but it's called Man Manaroda or Manarola. I, I'm not sure if it's a T, <clears throat> a T or an L. Looks like an L. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> I think it's an L. But... Yeah. Um, <clears throat> it's a hundred percent a premium acrylic and it's, uh, 262 yards in a, in a skein and the color lot is six, two, seven, six, six, zero, <clears throat> but it's just, it's like a gray, black and white and it's so pretty. And it's the sheen on it, like you can see like a real, real nice, <coughs> excuse me, shimmer to it. It's really nice stuff. Okay, now this, Ooh. okay, this I'm not entirely sure. <laughs> it's called Mayflower Spring, May, Mayflower, <laughs> Mayflower <coughs> Spring. And I don't, I think this is in a um, different language because... It literally spells out a word that I shouldn't yeah, say. Yeah, I know. It's, <laughs> it, it's in a different language. I have no idea what the, the fiber is in this. But she can show you the name. <laughs> we aren't going to say it. And then you could show them the, the fiber content or the fiber in there. Can you see that? <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> so it's 31% of something and 69% of something else. I'm going to assume it's an acrylic. Uh, and there's 115 meters in each ball. But, oh, did you show them the color? Yeah. <laughs> uh, the color is really cool, but it looks like it's a, a number one. Um, it's really, really fine. Really fine. It's almost like cross-stitch thread. That's how small it is. <clears throat> uh, I would not have got it if I hadn't known that. But I was attracted to the colors. So, yeah. Could so, you make like um, a dish rag or something with this? It feels like that it feels like that kind of a cotton. Like it feels like a dish 
rag cotton. <clears throat> but, I mean, I think I'm going to have to look up these names. It says it's made in Italy, so I don't know if these are Italian words or what, but... Um, yeah, it feels like that. It feels like a, a rough cotton. So, I got... Uh, oh, great! <laughs> I got six of them! Holy! <laughs> yeah! I got... Oh, this looks so pretty! I got five, ten balls. Wait a minute. Yeah, ten balls of this that it <clears throat> it's multicolor number one that's the name of it wow um it is co color number nine one one okay and it's a hundred percent acrylic again this is like a number one i find that most of hobie's yarns are like a one two maybe a three um so i just basically take two balls and you put them together their acrylic is very cottony it feels like cotton like a a rougher cotton <clears throat> i'm debating whether to order from hobie anymore um i've had a few orders from them and i haven't really had anything to write home about <clears throat> excuse me but I thought well I'll try it one more time I but I do like the reflective yarn <clears throat> be so cute as a dog sweater yeah that's that's what I was thinking look for <clears throat> diesel <laughs> I would need probably about 50 balls of this to make diesel a jacket <laughs> yeah <laughs> like just a cute little sweater that's all oh yeah are you hearing this? <laughs> yeah. So now okay. that boy's thick. He needs a lot. Dead. <laughs> 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 okay. So there you have it. Not impressed with this this lot. Um, but I mean, like like we said, like the this it feels just like cotton. I'm not a cotton person. I don't really like working with cotton. Lots of people love cotton, especially if it's premium cotton, but I'm just not a fan because I don't make many dishcloths. Actually, I don't think I make any, but um, I have made like soap scrubbies, but that's about it. Uh, most of my stuff is like scarves and hats and stuff like that, but so, but I mean, I think that this would make a good gift for someone who does like cotton because it, it does, it totally feels like it. So I guess that's it. <laughs> um, <clears throat> yeah, so, <laughs> so yeah, so I got a dog on my lap now and um, that's all I got for you for, for this yarn haul guys. Sorry it wasn't more exciting. Um, yeah, like I just don't think I'm going to be ordering from Hobie anymore because I'm just never really happy or impressed with their yarn. So, because I don't like working with thin yarn. Like I, I like working with a, smallest is a four. If I do work with a three, then I usually put two balls together and use two strands. So, <clears throat> um, yeah. So, and then now that Hobie M is closed, um, their stuff again was their stuff was good quality I really liked their stuff that's why if I got a thinner yarn with them I wouldn't bitch too much about it because it was good yarn but I think I'm gonna stick with ice yarns yeah ice yarns and Hirschners. Uh so but anyway okay so that's all I have for you for today for that now Tia and I are gonna do a special vlog <laughs> which hopefully we can get through it <laughs> let's hope yeah so <clears throat> anyways okay so i will talk to you guys later bye, bye.